Welcome back to another episode of Field Ready. Today we're going to be taking a look at the brand new Cedar CTA X2 rugged tablet from Juniper Systems. We're going to unbox the device, talk about the updated specs, and take a look at some of the key features that this device offers. All right, let's go ahead and unbox the CTA X2. Go ahead and remove the lid here, set that aside. The first thing we have is our device. Go ahead and sit that to the side so we can see what else comes in the box. Here we have our user's manual. This offers some additional information about the device and how to get started. We then have our included screen protector that you can apply to the device. And then underneath that, we have our charger and our USB-C charging cable. All right, now that we have it unboxed, let's take a look at what powers the device. The CTA X2 runs on the Android 10 operating system and is powered by an octa-core Snapdragon processor from Qualcomm. It features four gigabytes of RAM and 64 gigabytes of onboard storage. That storage is expandable via micro SD card and I'll show you how to do that a bit later. An 8,000 milliamp hour battery provides all day battery life and is removable. The device includes a front 5 megapixel camera and a rear 13 megapixel camera. The display is 8 inches diagonal with a resolution of 1280 by 800. A U-Blocks chip provides powerful GNSS and GPS capabilities to the device. All of this in a design that is sleek and rugged. An IP67 rating, Gorilla Glass, and corner bumpers allow the device to stay protected in harsh environments. So let's go ahead and take a look around. Here on the front, we have our front facing camera. And then along the bottom here, we have our physical buttons. These include volume buttons, a menu button, home button, back button, two function keys, as well as a power button. The nice thing about these function keys is that they are programmable in the software to perform functions on the tablet, such as triggering the barcode reader, an RFID reader, or other functions within applications. Taking a look here at the bottom, you can get a look at our USB-C charging port. And then flipping the device around, you get a look at the included hand strap, which comes pre-attached to the device. And this just adds an additional way of carrying the device while in the field. Now I'm gonna go ahead and pop this off so we can get a better look at what's back here. All right, with the hand strap removed, we can get a better look at the back of the device. We have our rear facing camera, flash, as well as a place for an external antenna for our GPS. And then we have a pin array here of pin pads, and this accepts our different expansion module pods. Our expansion pods include RJ45, barcode, RFID, and a combination RFID and barcode. We have our back speaker and then we have our battery door. The battery door is locked in in four different areas along the sides of the, of the door. So as we unlock each of those, we'll be able to access the battery. And you can see here on the battery door, this rubber seal, those locks lock this down to help give it its IP67 rating. And here we have our a look at our battery. This is an 8,000 milliamp hour battery. And it has one additional lock holding it into place. So go ahead and remove that. This gives us a clear look at the micro SD slot as well as our SIM slots. This device does support LTE. All right, let's go ahead and put that back together. Go ahead and drop the battery in into place. Lock that before we put the door on. And with the door securely attached, we'll go ahead and lock up each side. I want to thank you for joining me today for this first look at the Cedar CT8X2 from Juniper Systems. This device is now available, and you can learn more by visiting our website at junipersys.com. And we'll see you on the next episode of Field Ready. Mm -hmm.